Does the Tesla Cybertruck live up to the hype? I visited the Tesla showroom in Dallas, Texas to see for myself. Tesla enthusiasts swear it is the most technologically advanced vehicle on planet Earth, while haters claim that it is a poorly manufactured, panel gap filled piece of junk. So, what is the truth? On display is a Founder Series Cybertruck jacked up to its maximum height with aesthetic lighting to enhance its reflective stainless steel exterior. At first glance, this truck is an absolute beast. It feels like this truck was taken straight out of a video game, like it was shipped back in time from the future. It is grand, it is bold, and it is an absolute statement piece from Tesla. That being said, let's take a closer look at the fine details. Panel gaps. Tesla haters rave about the large panel gaps, ugly aesthetic, and overall neglect when it comes to build quality. Some have gone as far as to say that it looks like a DIY project. In this particular Founder Series Cybertruck, the panel gaps seem to be precise and consistent. Nowhere on the truck did I see one instance of imperfection. It could be that this display model was chosen for this reason, and that production trucks will not be built as well as this one. But I suspect that the panel gaps will be minimal as Tesla has learned from the past. Plenty of videos showcase the Cybertruck's functional capabilities. And since we are unable to test drive it, this video is mainly focused on the optics of the truck. In photos and videos, the truck can look a bit flat, but in person, the subtle curves in the body panels and glass are obviously noticeable, contributing to a more comfortable visual than expected. Those who have laid eyes on a Cybertruck in real life know that it looks much bigger in person. However, when compared to the Ford F-150 Raptor, even though it looks larger, it is quite a bit smaller. Here you can see how tall the truck is compared to the height of a Ford F-150 Raptor. My theory is that the slanted roof that connects to the bed actually gives the illusion that the truck is bigger than it really is. The windshield and windshield wiper are gigantic. In fact, the Cybertruck windshield is the largest piece of glass on any production vehicle ever. And since there is only one windshield wiper to clean it, well, you get the idea. The bumpers look exactly like expected and have a high quality appearance. At almost 35 inches in diameter, the tires are big and the hubcaps look pretty cool too. The headlight bar is different from anything we've seen in any other production vehicle. The tail light is also one straight bar across the back, super sleek, super simple. Some reviewers have stood on the tonneau cover to showcase its strength, and I've got to say, it looks sturdy. These buttons engage the power open and power close features. Not only does it look shocking at first glance, but the attention to detail by Tesla engineers is on full display with this truck. Even small things like the hidden charge port incorporated seamlessly into the fender flares. Speaking of smooth panels, Tesla is known for having flush doors with handles sunken into the door, but this takes it to a whole new level as Tesla has removed door handles completely on this truck. Simply push the button on the door pillar and it will pop open. This not only enhances the aesthetic of the truck, but will improve its aerodynamics for better energy efficiency. This side window is a thoughtful addition for added visibility. Neutral accents allow for easy customization, like wrapping the vehicle in virtually any color. Speaking of customization, you can see that the Founder Series graphic is etched into the stainless steel. We were not allowed to get too close to the truck, but from what I could capture, the interior is as expected with its minimalist design. Does Tesla Cybertruck live up to the hype. I was already a fan of the Cybertruck from pictures and videos alone, but seeing it in person, it absolutely exceeds expectations. It is more grand than expected, the build quality is phenomenal, and there is tremendous potential for customization. Please consider supporting the channel by using my referral code to schedule yourself a free test drive or to purchase your vehicle. It's kind of a cool way to show that you found value in this video. Subscribe for more tech videos, and I'll see you in the next one.